Welcome back to Final Fantasy XIV. And I've got my archer up to 60, so he cannot get any more experience. Uh, let's see. Let's turn that back on. There we go. So before, I'm working on my Lancer now. Another damage class. And before we hit up our level 15 quest, let's go get a promotion. Bam. You qualify for your next promotion. You must complete a trial as well as complete rank 2 in the Grand Copy Objective of your hunting block. I see that you have already accomplished both. Very well. I should make the necessary arrangements for your promotion. You're currently Chief Storm Sergeant to qualify for Second Storm Lieutenant. You must fulfill the following requirements. And there we go. We've got it. Second Storm Lieutenant. In the name of the Admiral, I hereby appoint you to the rank of Second Storm Lieutenant. By this promotion, you're now eligible to transfer between the three Grand Companies of Azora. In order to entice more capable individuals to join Grand Companies, the Alliance leaders recently introduced a system which allows members of one organization the freedom to transfer to another. If you wish to shift your allegiance, you may do so by speaking with the personnel officer of the Grand Companies you wish to join. The procedure incurs a registration fee, though this payment is waived the first time you transfer. In addition to this privilege, you are also entitled to purchase land or an apartment in one of the residential districts established for adventurer use. If you have an interest in owning an estate in another property, I suggest you consult the resident caretaker in the district you fancy. Among the other things, you'll be able to learn how to go about purchasing a plot of land and building a hall upon it. I think I'm good. So you are now able to change your grand company of allegiance to proceed with this necessary paperwork. Speak with personnel officer at any grand company headquarters. Do note upon changing allegiance, all assets, company seals will be frozen, and some items such as company specific gear may no longer be equipable. Ooh, that's something. Furthermore, there is a cooling off period of 15 days during which time you'll be able to apply for another transfer. Awesome. Okay. So we've got our upgrade. We got a couple systems unlocked. But, what level are they? 15, 47? Yeah, we'll wait for a little bit to do them. Let's just head over to New Grinia. And let's do our next Lancer quest. Let's see, I believe there was a leather Lancers right there. Yeah, it's opened up for me. Where's the guy at? There he is. What do we got? Uh, brass spear, piercing talent, delivers a ranged attack. Let's see. Ooh, a ranged attack. That's what I've been needing. As for the gear, I'll just pick something. Guildmaster Eugenia urgently needs you to travel to the East Shroud in this stead. We'll accept. Ah, oh, Tickman, you come at a good time. I urgently require your help. Seriously, Abelago, our old friend Frogus, paid us another visit, seemingly intent upon reprising the performance he gave on the day of your first meeting. As on that occasion, he raved till the air was thick was salad, declaring every soul who he met his gaze more raven than the last. This time, however, not all ears were deaf to his myriad provocations. It seems one of your young members took offense at his words and demanded satisfaction of the rogue. 
the two have since departed to duel in East Shroud. Had I been on hand, I would have been such folly, and rebuked the lad for letting pride cloud his judgment. Alas, I learned of it too late, and the boy is gone. All we can do now is ensure that the hot-headed fool does not come to lasting harm. I would have departed in pursuit of the pair ere you came, but my duties keep me here. That is why I turn to you now, sick man. Pray go to the East Shroud in my stead and watch over our comrade. All right, so what I got from that was he wasn't here when the debate happened, but now he's here and he can't leave. So can you leave or can you not leave? That's the question. Either way, let's go. Is that it? Yeah, that's it. Let's head on up. Alright. Teleporting to the East Shroud. I guess I could've just ran. Too late. Try to stop it. Could've taken the ferry over there. But all's good. Do I have any upgrades? I do not have any upgrades right now. I've been running dungeons, as you can see. I got a little bit of good gear here. Oh, and I'm almost level 20. Which means we can knock out that quest as well. Soon I'll be caught back up to my... Uh, once I get like level 40 or 50. Oh. Uh-oh. What happened? Grown. So we meet again. Do you remember who I am? I trust. I. Who are you again? <laughs> you wounded me. How could you possibly forget your mentor? He taught you the true meaning of courage. Well, it is of little consequence. But you have forgotten the teacher. It is plain that you have not forgotten his teachings. I understand that you were able to retrieve the stone of courage and the spirit hole. It seems I was right about you. Ah, you had the makings of a true lancer, unlike those charlatans at the lancer skill. It is well that you have come to me, or have just the trial for you. One that will do wonders for your courage. Not interested, you say? Ah, but you have no choice. Should you refuse, well, suffice it to say that I would not be able to guarantee the safety of your comrade here. Oh, sneaky. When last we spoke, I told you that a lancer may forge true courage only in the midst of great danger. Needless to say, the threat posed by ordinary creatures is insignificant. You must needs seek out a better spot for sport. Ah, but fear not, for I have taken the liberty of finding you something suitable. Take this alchemy potion and sprinkle it upon the exposed root yonder. Root yonder. Doing so will garner the wrath of a certain creature, which you must then strike down. Very well. I can do that. I'll do that all day. Where are we at? There we go. Uh, Alchemic Potion, Highly Toxic Liquid, entrusted to you by the Rogue Lancer Valquis. Alright, here we go. Ooh, level 18, down blood, eh? Yeah, he's going down. Need a blood poker, we don't get him. There it goes. Got anything more challenging for me there, buddy? So you have vanquished the treant. Well done. By striking down that frenzy creature, you have further strengthened your courage. Hmm, are you sure, comrade? Oh, I shall. Once you have completed our next trial, this one will pit against you multitude of foes. Make your way to the light. 
Life men stump in the central shroud. Once there, seek out a likely spot among the forest path to lie in wait. Man-eating wolves are wont to hunt there this time of year. And it should not be long before a pack appears. When the beasts show themselves, you are to slay their leader, the Alpha Wolf. I shall be observing from up close. The better to offer you advice. Alright, so now we need to go over there. Let's see if we can take that little road right there. Save that little bit of gear we got. And now we got to looks like go across this river and up into the hole over there. proceed these wolves want some of me they gonna get it oh somebody's here with me You are to be congratulated, Tickman. By throwing yourself into the midst of danger, you have further tempered your courage. And in the process, you have brought peace to the life men stump, a place considered sacred by the people of Gridania. Having undertaken my trials, you must now see that those issued by the guild are not but child's play. Mine is the one true path to courage. All others lead to ergonomy. If you wish to become a lancer worth the, the name, I suggest you leave your wain in his house of cravens, never to return. <laughs> no, no. For your sake, I pray you do soon. Till we meet again. You're just trying to get me to leave. I ain't trying to leave none of that. We gotta go now. Report to Yewen. So it's back in Ukraine. Let's do a quick teleport. Get our new lance. Ethernet, Lancer's Guild. Man. 
Maybe this will get us up to level 20. Who knows? Who knows? Alright, Guildmaster, talk to me. Tick man, thank the god you're safe. That young fool of Lance returned, but moments ago. And through choked tears and recounted to me all that transpired. I understand, Focus. Again, attempted to force upon you his corrupted notion of courage. I cannot say this is this often enough. A lancer strikes his courage by tempering his composure and resolve, not by rushing headlong into danger. You were able to overcome for these trails, tis true. Yet, know that you did so by virtue of true courage, that is, courage born of composure and resolve. You flattered. You faltered not before the fury of a frenzied trant, nor did you succumb to panic when surrounded by bloodthirsty wolves. Owing you to this, you were able to perform the fullest of your potential. You have come far, Tick Man. It's past time that I taught you the piercing talent technique, one of the most versatile weapons in the Lancer's arsenal. It may serve you well. Now, must needs decide what course of action to take with regard to your self-appointed mentor. Though no lives were lost, this latest incident only serves to confirm what I have long suspected. The Falcus will cause great harm if left to propagate his corrupted notion of courage. You must be persuaded to desist, though I do not yet know how. Mayhap his regard for, your, for you could be turned to our advantage. But leave such considerations to me. For the time being, you'll do well to put Falquez from your mind. Focus on your training and strive to master the techniques I have taught you. I look forward to our next meeting. And there we go. Let's go ahead and get... I don't know. Let's go ahead and get the hat, I guess. And complete. Action learn, piercing talent. Awesome. Now we got a ranged attack. But we're still not 20. So let's check our gear real quick. Ooh, a new hat. And a brass spear clip. Thank you. And that's going to complete it for today. So thanks for joining me. When we come back, we might do the level 20 quest. So until then, y'all take care.